The World Games are coming in July of 2022. Sumo, softball, lacrosse, sport climbing, powerlifting, and more. This is the new generation of sports. Tickets are on sale. Buy today at TWG2022.com. Hey, it's Scott Martin with your weather video for the morning of July 31st, 2021. Just like Friday, today will be hot and humid with showers and thunderstorms becoming likely by mid-afternoon. Some of this activity could become strong to marginally severe with gusty winds. It will be the same story on Sunday as well. Here's what I have for you in today's video. All of central Alabama remains in a heat advisory for all of today and through 9 p.m. on Sunday night. A heat advisory will go into effect today at 10 a.m. for all of north Alabama and is set to expire this evening at 7 p.m. Dangerous heat is expected across the area with peak heat index values expected to range from 105 to 110 degrees. Now, diving into the 06Z run of the GFS starting with today valid at 4 p.m. With the boundaries left over from the storms that formed last night along with an approaching cold front, convective development is likely across central Alabama during the main heating of the day today. Scattered to numerous showers and thunderstorms can be expected, some of which may be strong to marginally severe with gusty winds being the main threat. Highs will be in the mid to upper 90s. As troughing moves into the area, bringing the cold front along with it on Sunday, showers and storms will be likely again. Much of the activity will start in the north and will push southward throughout the afternoon. Once again, a few strong to marginally severe storms will be possible, with gusty winds being the main threat. Highs will range from the lower 90s in the north to the mid and upper 90s in the south. Shower and thunderstorm chances will continue to stay elevated on Monday as the front continues to hang out over the northern parts of the area. Skies will be mostly cloudy and highs will be in the 80s. The front finally starts to move southward on Tuesday and will push much of the shower and thunderstorm activity over the extreme southern portions of the area. However, we still can't rule out a few isolated showers and storms over the northern two-thirds of central Alabama. Highs will be in the 80s. Wednesday looks like we return to more of the typical summertime weather we expect to see in central Alabama. Mostly sunny with a slight chance of a few isolated to scattered afternoon showers and storms. Highs will be in the mid to upper 80s. Thursday and Friday will be pretty similar as skies will be mostly sunny with a slight chance of a few isolated to scattered afternoon showers and storms. Highs will be in the mid to upper 80s on both days. Now taking a look at the tropics. All is quiet across the Atlantic Basin and tropical cyclone formation is not expected within the next five days. That will do it for today's video. We'll have notes on the blog throughout the day. I'll be back with your video tomorrow morning. James Spann returns from vacation on Monday. I'm Scott Martin signing off for today. Have a great day and God bless.